Hi, I'm Taya. Are you ready for the Wombat Wobble? Come sing with me. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Do the didgeridoo and the Wombat Wobble and the Kangaroo and the Emu too. Jump in the air and turn around And say to mum and dad and all your friends in a big love heart I love you! Do the crocodile snap And the cockadoo flap And the penguin walk And the little seal clap Jump in the air Woo! And turn around And say to mum and dad and all your friends in a big love heart I love you! Did you notice anything about all the things that I sang in the song? That's right! All the things in the song are from Australia Or at least things that can be found in Australia Australia is a country. It's a big landmass that's entirely surrounded by water. And so Australia is an island. That's where I live. <laughs> what am I playing? That's right, I'm playing the didgeridoo. Can you play it like that? Did you know that the didgeridoo is traditionally called the yiraki? It's what it's called in the Yongu language. It became known as the didgeridoo because of the sound that it makes. Do you hear it? It is the world's oldest wind instrument, played by the First Nations people of Australia, the indigenous people. Can you show me how you would play the didgeridoo? It's a long instrument and you hold it to your mouth. Remember that for the song. Can you show me your wombat wobble? That's it! <laughs> Did you know that the wombat is the only animal in the world that can poo out cubes? That's right. When it poops, its poo comes out in the shape of cubes. So if you ever go walking in the Australian bush and you find cubed poo stacked on top of each other, you'll know that a wombat has wobbled by. What's that? It's a kangaroo. That's right. They like to hop on really strong legs and use their tails for balance. Did you know that kangaroos are marsupials? It means that they give birth to live babies that crawl up into the mum's pouch and that's where they drink milk and grow until they're ready to hop out of the pouch and jump around by themselves. What's that? It's an emu. Can you show me the emu? <laughs> they have long necks and a beak because they are birds. They have wings, but they don't fly. They're Australia's largest flightless bird. They have powerful legs and they can run up to 48 kilometers an hour. That's as fast as a car in a neighborhood. What's that? It's a crocodile. Can you snap like a crocodile? Did you know that crocodiles are the largest reptiles in the world? They can grow up to six meters long. There are lots of them in Australia, especially up in the Northern Territory. What's that? It's a bird flapping. What kind of bird? It's a cockatoo. There are lots of them in Australia. They're easily recognized by their white feathers and yellow crest. Did you know that cockatoos, the mum and the dad, they take turns incubating the eggs in the nest? That's good teamwork. What's that? It's a penguin. Can you do a penguin walk? 
Australia has lots of little fairy penguins. They stand only 30 centimeters tall. They are the smallest penguins in the world. What's that? I'm clapping like a seal. That's right, can you clap like a seal? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Australia has lots of brown fur seals. Did you know that they're called the brown fur seal? Because, well, the fur is brown, but they have two layers of fur. They need these two layers so that their skin underneath the fur stays dry even when they're underwater. Isn't that a clever way to stay warm? What other Australian animals do you know? Australia has quite a lot of them. We can learn about that another time. Right now, let's sing Wombat Wobble again. Are you ready to dance this time? Do the didgeridoo and the wombat wobble and the kangaroo and the emu too. Jump in the air and turn around and say to mum and dad and all your friends in a big love heart, I love you. Do the crocodile snap and the cockadoo flap and the penguin walk and the little seal clap. Jump in the air, woo, and turn around. And say to mum and dad and all your friends in a big love heart, I love you. I had so much fun learning about Australian animals and dancing with you. I'll see you next time. Thank you.